Kelly, did you take something out of the fridge? Well, I live here, so it's likely. Okay, did you take a bag with meat in it out of the fridge? Possibly. Did it have your name on it? It did, actually. There was a label with my first and last name and a bunch of other information. Did you eat anything like that? I might have. You're joking. What? When there's a bunch of other stuff on the label, it distracts from the name. Our rule is that the name has to be clearly printed. Kelly, that was my kidney. For real? I had an operation this morning and they removed one of my kidneys. That's what you ate. Huh. Any other thoughts besides huh? Other than the thing about the label? This is your reaction? You ingested a vital organ. Just how vital is it really, Drew? I mean, you did say one of. The amount of things about this situation that are concerning me are multiplying exponentially by the second, but for some reason, what I think takes priority right now is an apology. Explain. Forgetting about the fact that it was part of my anatomy, you ate something that wasn't yours out of the fridge. Even if you didn't see the label, you had to know it wasn't yours. That's the principle. Oh, so like when you ate my apples from when I went apple picking? Okay, you're right. This is different. You ate my kidney. You've said that. What you haven't said is why your kidney was in the fridge in the first place. I had it removed. And you wanted to keep it? For what? To look at it? Drew, chronic kidney failure affects 14% of the population. That's one in seven Americans, 37 million people. You don't think one of them could have used one of your kidneys, which we both know was healthy and functioning? They suffer while you perform some sort of science experiment on yourself and then keep it as a souvenir. That's sick, truly. It was for great Aunt Lola. I was going to surprise her with it. Uh, sure, Drew, and they let you leave the hospital with it? Okay, let's go with that. Screw you! Don't blame me. I'm not the one with some twisted hobby that involves removing and preserving your own internal organs, which, by the way, cannot be legal. Shut up. And I'm the monster for not being able to read a label with small print? Did it even occur to you the fact that I have astigmatism? Meanwhile, you're teaching yourself surgery? Why, why don't you become a surgeon instead of cutting into yourself like a masochistic pinata? Sorry you don't get to play with your prize this time, weirdo. You're the worst. Am I? I should get his other kidney.